story. Oh, good. He left me my favorite power bars. Hmm. Hmm. until I can get some meat. <laughs> oh, God. It's so good to be finally really awake. Oh, look at that sun. Mm, so beautiful and warm. Oh, I just want to lay back down and Go back to sleep. No, wait, 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 wait. Oh, the sun is actually pretty far up in the sky. Oh, I've slept in late already. Oh, it's a special day, the first day of spring. Oh, wait. That means he's supposed to be meeting me. Well, right about now. Oh, no. Okay, I just need to leave my den. Okay, and turn left at the stream. Over there is the pond. That's for later. Okay, keep going past this clearing and then to here. Wow, it looks different with the trees all having leaves, but this is the place. Oh, no. Did he get tired of waiting for me and go home? Is this even the right day? Did I oversleep that much? Wait, someone's coming. They smell. Good. Oh, there you are. <laughs> Yay. I feel like I've been waiting forever. Come here and give me a hug. Mm. Mm, God, it feels like it's been years. Oh, not just a few winter months. Thank you for meeting me all the way out here. I mean, you could just wait and I'd come to you, but you didn't. You made sure that you'd be the first person I see. Mm. I really appreciate that. You're the best human. <laughs> but it must have been bad for you, too. You were awake all winter. No one to kiss or cuddle or, you know. <laughs> Fine, laugh at me because I'm still a little shy about saying it out loud. We've been friends forever, but we didn't really start mating until last year. I had some bad dreams before I woke up. <laughs> I dreamed that I woke up and you weren't here. You'd found somebody else or you just couldn't wait for me to wake up. No, I, I know, I trust you, it's, it's not that, I don't know why I have those dreams, I think I'm just kind of insecure, <sighs> yeah, I mean, it's one thing for a cute human boy like you to say you want to be with me, but to actually have to wait for three months to mate again, that's something else, <laughs> And yeah, I don't think of you as a cheater, but let's face it, I am not exactly the kind of girl you see on Instagram. Hmm. <laughs> I'm a lot bigger than you, for starters. People tell me that most guys aren't into tall girls. <laughs> I'm glad that you're still the exception. Plus, I guess, I'm still not happy with my body, you know. <sighs> Before I go into hibernation, I always feel too big, even though you never complain about me being extra thick. <laughs> and now when I come out, I feel too thin for you. Ugh. <laughs> the media really sets an unrealistic expectation on us bear girls. We can't all be cute like human girls, or graceful like deer girls, or even slender like ferret girls. It's ridiculous. <sighs> Sorry. You know how I get, especially right after I wake up. 
and I'm starving. <laughs> I ate all of the power bars you left me by my den for when I woke up. That was really nice, by the way. But I need some meat. Is that what's in the basket? Did, did you bring the sweet, blessed meat of my dreams? Oh. My. God, is that brisket? Did you make me brisket? And bring barbecue sauce? And, and my favorite root beer? Oh, and buttery potatoes? Mmm! <laughs> oh, come on. I found a place to set up our picnic. It's right over here. I actually chose it before I went to sleep even before the first snows. I didn't want to see anything because I didn't know how it would look in the spring, you know. But look, isn't it so beautiful? <sighs> There's so much sun to lounge in and the trees are all in bloom and the pond is just so perfect and clear. Mmm, that perfect place to, you know. <laughs> I mean, yeah, so I thought we could get caught up, eat, and then when we're done, we could snuggle out here. Oh, I missed your snuggles a lot. <laughs> no, I don't think you understand. I really miss your snuggles. <laughs> you better get used to being a little spoon, mister, because I'm going to snuggle you until you're just a little cuddle puddle. But first, that brisket plate please <laughs> thank you oh you have no idea how much i appreciate you making this for me and, uh, and poor girls have some trouble getting enough food sometimes mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Uh, both before and recovering from hibernation <laughs> Mmm. Mmm. Oh, but you remembered that, didn't you? Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mmm. Oh, that was delicious. Mmm. <laughs> You're such a thoughtful mate, you know that. Yeah, I guess, um, I should have asked you about being my mate before I went to sleep. But, uh, I was afraid. So, yeah, we started, you know, before I went to sleep. But we've been friends forever and kissing friends for a while after that. So it just seemed natural to be your girlfriend. I, uh, I started to think of you as more than that, though. I started to think about you as my mate, but <laughs> I guess I never actually talked to you about it or asked you. I think that's why I was so insecure, you know? Why I had those terrible dreams where you didn't want to be with me anymore. Because I was a coward, a scaredy bear. And I never even asked you or talked to you about it, but I was afraid, I'm still afraid, and it's a big step... I know you might not be ready, and I understand if you're not, or if if you need time to think, or even if you don't love me as much as I love you, I, I know things like that happen. What I'm, what I'm saying, really slowly, is I really want you to be my mate. So you don't have to answer now, but you can't. <sighs> okay, well, that's not exactly an answer, but... <laughs> Fine. I get the point. This is your charming way of saying yes. Mm. Mm, good. Now, are there any naughty human girls I need to chase off? Any wolf girls I need to fight to assert dominance over? Hey, I can fight. I'm big and tough and mean. Arrgh. Don't, don't laugh. I'm scary. 
Everyone knows Bear Girls are the scurriest girls. Hmm. See? Even you jumped a little bit. Oh, whoops. <gasps> I didn't see there were other people out here. Sorry! Aw, they look cute. They're a couple out walking and enjoying the spring weather, just like us. Anyway, that doesn't matter. I'm not hungry anymore, which means I need cuddles. <laughs> ah, so come over here and lay down and we can, like, just be here together. Yes, in front of them, I don't mind. I'm serious. I want people to see us together. With my paws all over you. So they know to stay away. Because you're my mate. <laughs> Yeah, I growl. I growl when I get possessive. Plus, I know how you love it when I give you public snuggles and hold hands and hug you. You like being mine and knowing it, don't you? <laughs> so get over here and lay next to me on this blanket. Ah, there, just like that, so I can lump all over you. <laughs> <laughs> My evil plan has come to fruition at last. You are the littlest spoon. <laughs> Seriously. I know you love this, too. I missed you. Sometimes I wish you hibernated, too, so we could just be together out there. But I know that wouldn't work. <laughs> You have human things to do, and I accept that. Oh, I just need more of this. Mm -hmm. Did you just make a cute little human noise? <laughs> I knew you missed this as much as I did. So, um, I know I just woke up, but... I'm tired after eating all that food. <laughs> Do you want to take a nap with me for a little bit? And then maybe we can go home? Hmm. Cool. Um, love you.